Georgia Cat so bad. I want to be Doja Cat so bad. She's so cool. I don't know, something about her. Like, I'll be watching her scopes, and I'll be like, damn, like, that bitch. That bitch is real. Like, that bitch. <laughs> no, but seriously, um, let's finish some shit today. Do I look like her? Oh, my God, that's all I want to be. Reconstructive surgery. I needed more cheekbones. And these are all implants here and also in the jaw because you know she has a big, big, large, huge jaw. She has like a crazy, like. Have you guys seen Gerald's game? She looks like the eclipse, like the moonlight, the moonlight man. You know what I'm saying? But in the jaw. And that's what I, I wanted to achieve. So I got a jaw implant. As well as my cheekbones. Alright, this is going nowhere. What am I doing? <laughs> like sitting here roasting myself for like five minutes. But, um... There's a couple things we can finish today. Uh, we have drunk that we did last night. We did one verse too, the first verse, but we, uh, no, it was a joke. No, I, I don't have anything, anything on my body done except for my scalp. My scalp is fake. This is not my scalp. This is like fat, cheap Walgreens foundation. Fit me, Maybelline specifically. And, uh, this hair is plastic. Um, okay, what was I gonna do? Fuck. There is a gnat in my room. There's been, like, one or two gnats. And they've just been circling around. I'm sure they're dead. I think they've drowned in a, in a glass of wine that I left out. But I plugged this up, and I really don't... I'm not trying to deal with, uh... The nastiness. Did you, did you catch that? Did you get that? Yeah, it's funny. Only to me. All right. Um. So I I like what we did. I think it was I I sorry correction. I love what we did. I think last night was dope. Um. It up. Oh, there he goes. He's in there. been bugging me though for the past since I finished it since last night I've been listening to it on repeat why the fuck does this sound like this is it because the gain is so high what is it like like the low is really high listen like, what the fuck is that Hypnotize me Does hypnotic make you want some more? That's really getting on my fucking nerves 
Boy, surprise me Swimming to the ocean floor oh, Hypnotize me Is hypnotic make you want some more? Boy, surprise me it sounds like it's like going through a phone or something or like a like one of those like things pause like those little yeah thing what are they called <laughs> fucking I forgot what they're called oh, there's like all the other vocals around it I didn't do it do anything with like it's this me a megaphone, but I didn't, you know. Yeah, I had just do what I usually do, Pinky. I just. Boy, surprise me. Swim into the ocean Yeah, the gain is too high. That's the only other thing that I think it would be. called me I'm gonna text her and be like mom because she I always answer but this time no mom what I'm on periscope what is it we have so far that would be the outro the i, I go for you why i 
That's the outro, but... Oh, no. I feel like I could get a feature on that shit. No, I think it's boring if you're not selling sex. Like, if I could, wear, if I wore turtlenecks my whole career, I think I would not be doing what I'm doing. Like, there's, I'm sorry, yes, sure, there's versatility in wearing a fucking turtleneck and, and, and socks and gloves and covering your body and a hijab, but I'm just not that girl, so... Like, there's people who will wear turtlenecks their whole career, you know? There's, like, modest people, but art doesn't have to be modest. And art doesn't have to be sexual. Art doesn't have to be anything, because art is, 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 it's not, it's not linear. It's fucking abstract in any sense, in every sense. So, no, you don't to be successful because being one and yes it's subjective to be successful means so many things uh if you mean make it you know be highly promoted yeah people are weak for sexy you know people fucking love sexy people 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 want sexy people enjoy sexy something that's not sexy doesn't mean it's even something that's not sexy doesn't mean it's not sexy. That's a whole other tangent. Yeah, you know, it's not, like, it's up to you. You know, you can't point the finger at somebody who is sexual for something that you can't provide. Which is modest art. Usually it's people who don't make modest art. And don't make any art whatsoever put any put any sort of sort of uh they don't pitch they don't pitch in they don't do anything for the art community or for the entertainment or whatever the fuck industry or music industry who who constantly criticize people who who are sexual naturally there's people who, like, try to do the sexy thing. I can't even think of somebody who's done the sexy thing and doesn't really seem sexy. Usually when someone's sexy, they're just sexy. I don't even think that it, if... You, no, no one label, for a better word, puts money into something they don't believe in. So when you think about it, it's you allowing the sexy, and your friends who say, ooh, I'm going to buy that, I'm going to buy that album, I'm going to look up this artist, and I'm going to stay tuned for whatever they're going to do next, because they're sexy. So it's the people, it's not, it's not the labels, <laughs> it's definitely not the labels, because labels are uncreative, they're full of people who know only the business, they're not, they're not at home making splatter paintings of dicks. They're, like, completely the opposite. They're very, you know, savvy people when it comes to business. And it's, some, it's very hard to have both. It's very hard to be very creative. And, you know, it's you can have an understanding of someone's talent and an understanding of some, obviously, someone's uh, potential and be business savvy, but... No. If you're asking me, do, do people have to... Yes, sex sells bottom line. If you're asking me, do you have to be sexy? No, you don't. But you should be. You should be a little bit sexy. And I think there's something sexy about everyone. So you don't have to try. You don't have to try so hard. You don't have to, like, swing your dick around like a lasso. Just be yourself. I'd, I'd say the best thing you can do, do for your, your career and your brand is be yourself. It's so easy. <laughs> it's very easy. It's very easy if you don't overthink shit all the time. And even I overthink shit, but I...
like, wake up myself. I have no other choice anyway. I can't be anyone else. So even if I am trying to be like someone else, I'm still me, whether I like it or not. But embrace that. Embrace being yourself. Embrace that. Yeah, I think everyone overthinks. I think it's really natural. I think it's actually kind of healthy, to be honest. To a certain extent. But embrace being yourself. Because people will be themselves, but they're like... Like, and not... Mm, like they don't, mm. but that other person is doing something that I like way better than I am. You feel me? I never think about many things, things that I can't remember. And I only overthink when I'm upset, usually. When I'm, when I'm even the slightest of upset or annoyed by something than I overthink because I'm already thinking about something else while I'm trying to think about what's at hand say uh, something happened to me a moment ago and it made me upset overthinking is when you have too many thoughts so you're thinking about what just happened but right now you're trying to do an entirely different thing say I'm trying to make this song I can't even think of what the fuck else to press because I'm not thinking about that. My body is doing what, what my thoughts were going to do. I'm s slapping the keyboard. And I know I'm doing it, but I don't know why. Because I'm thinking about some other shit. So that's, that's, that's what that is. <laughs>